Welcome to Tech Brothers with Amir. In this video, I'm going to show you how to grant select permission on a table or tables to user in MariaDB. Let's uh, go to Linux box where we have installed MariaDB. I'm going to connect to MariaDB by using the, our root uh, user. So root, provide the password and uh, we'll be all connected here. And uh, I'm going to say show databases. Uh, that will show me all the databases. Uh, I would like to create uh, a user called uh, TB and provide permission on uh, Tech Brothers database. Um, okay, so what you will do, you will say create user, and then uh, in the single quotes, you provide the name of the user, at the rate, and the host. Uh, so in our case, it's a local host and uh, identified by password. So password is going to be 123 all good and now if i would like to provide the permission on a single table in tech brothers uh, so first of all i need to see the tables right so we'll say use uh, tech brothers and uh, here i'm going to say show tables uh, and it will show me all the tables uh, i have table employee and i have table test um, so if i would like to provide uh, permission only on only employee to the TB user how I would do that uh, so here we will say grant and uh, then we will say select uh, and we will say uh, on and uh, then we will provide a database name tech brothers dot employee and uh, make sure uh, you provide the database uh, name in the same case uh, here we have uh, uh, tech brothers you see that B is capital and uh, it is case sensitive so you have to provide the exact name of the database uh, otherwise uh, sometime you will have a problem uh, I have uh, made a previous video where we have created uh, uh, or provided the permission with the different case uh, uh, of um, uh, of the database name it did uh, went through but actually did not uh, provide the permission on actual database uh, so it is case sense to make sure you provide exact name of the tables and database uh, and uh, we'll say to tb and uh, at the rate localhost so notice that uh, here we are only providing uh, the permission uh, to single uh, table uh, and uh, we missed the colon here Sing, uh, single quote sorry and uh, now we are going to go ahead and do it so we have provided a select permission to employee table in tech brothers uh, now exit from here and then we'll log in with the tech uh, tb so you say u tb dash p and the uh, uh, password is one two three now if we say show databases uh, it should show us uh, two databases one is information schema another one is tech brothers uh, so if we'll say sh use uh, tech brothers uh, we are in tech brothers now and we say show tables uh, and if you notice that uh, uh, we have only one table here uh, if you remember when i logged in with the root user uh, we had uh, uh, we were able to see two tables uh, so tech brothers has actually two tables employee and test uh, but as the permission to the tb user is uh, only on employee that's why this is the only table it is a uh, seeing uh, so if i will say select asterisk uh, from employee uh, we should be able to see the data if i will say drop table uh, uh, employee so let's see what happened so you see that it is telling us uh, this one does not have uh, permission to drop the table okay great now if we want to exit exit from here and uh, then uh, we would like to uh, provide all the permission to the user then uh, this is the, the way we will do we'll come back with the user root and then provide the permission to the tb so we would like to grant uh, select uh, on tech brothers dot asterisk so we are saying on database tech brothers and then on all the objects so we would like to provide select statement so now it can select the, uh, the data from uh, all the tables which are present in tech brothers and uh, we'll say two and tb at the rate dot uh, then we'll say single quote localhost and uh, that's it now if we will uh, log in sorry we have missed this extra single code here so I'm gonna go back to this query and uh, put the single quote here and then terminate so now we have uh, 
provide the select permission uh, on tech browsers uh, and uh, in all the tables uh, now we can go back here and uh, we can exit from here come back with the uh, user tb dash p and uh, now provide the password and now if we say show databases uh, we should be able to see all the databases here and the uh, user tech brothers and now show tables and we should be able to see all the tables here we have we, we were not able to see a uh, test uh, table last time and we provided only permission to the employee as we have provided the permission uh, on all the tables uh, so you see here tech brother dot asterisk so all the tables uh, and now we are able to see all the tables in the tech browser database so i want to select data from test data test uh, um, table i can select i can select the data from uh, um, employee table and uh, if i would like to drop the table i would not be able to drop or delete or update the data from these tables i have only select permission um, thanks very much for watching this video and i will see you guys uh, in next video